Bitcoin has a scalability problem. Yes, it's an amazing distributed ledger, but it can't capture the entire world's commerce. Why? We established that nodes keep track of every single transaction that occur. So now if nodes had to track all global transactions, it's not only going to slow down the network, it's going to make it very difficult to operate a node. So we need a solution that doesn't sacrifice the security and decentralization of the blockchain. Now, in the white paper, it goes to say that Visa achieved 47,000 transactions per second during the 2013 holidays. Bitcoin has seven transactions per second as it currently <clears throat> enables or accepts one megabyte per block for its size. And with SegWit, that can vary between two to four, but one megabyte is its, is its constraint. So if a transaction is 300 bytes and at 47 transactions per second, when you do the math out, it requires 8.46 gigabytes per block, which means running a node will be too, ex too expensive and not accessible to all, which defeats the open source nature of Bitcoin and making it easy for everyone. So to achieve a visa-like capacity, Bitcoin needs to conduct transactions off the chain rather than on the chain.